This is my favorite AB Calc topic. Are you ready? And here we have the last question of the first part in the AB Calculus exam. And in this one, they are asking us to find dy over dx for this function here. And the first thing that we can notice that this is inverse sine. So we have that specific formula that we want to use for this one. So we know that the derivative of inverse sine is one over square root one minus x squared. And now since we have the five x inside the sign, we need to use the chain rule. So we get dy over dx to be one over square root one minus five x squared times the derivative of the inside one function, which in this case would be five. So then this simplifies to five over square root one minus 25 x squared or answer choice E.